The SV Ilyushin Aviation Complex, an established Russian manufacturer of the Il-76 and Il-96, and a key supplier of components for the Sukhoi Superjet, SSJ-100, is making a substantial technological advancement by acquiring sophisticated processing and security systems based on NVIDIA and AMD chips. This action is a component of a more extensive modernization initiative at the Voronezh facility, which indicates the company's dedication to digital transformation and the broader Russian strategy of technological self-reliance. Currently, the facility's digital infrastructure is being upgraded through a procurement process that is valued at over 717 million rubles. The tender includes various security hardware software systems, high-performance workstations, network switches, and hardware software systems for access control and management. It is important to note that the technical specifications require discrete graphics cards that are outfitted with GDDR6X memory. This memory is a feature of NVIDIA's RTX 30 and 40 series, including the RTX 4070, 3060 Ti, and 3060, as well as certain AMD models like the RX 7900 XT. The necessity for flexibility and performance in the facility's new digital backbone is emphasized by the inclusion of both NVIDIA and AMD processors, Despite AMD's general preference for GDDR6 due to cost issues, this procurement is not solely concerned with the enhancement of computers. It is also intended to facilitate the development of the next generation of Russian aviation manufacturing. The Sukhoi Superjet represents Russia's aspirations in the regional jet market, while the Il-76 and Il-96 families are indispensable to both civil and military aviation. By incorporating powerful GPUs from NVIDIA and AMD, PJSCIL is guaranteeing that its design, simulation, and security systems can cope with the escalating demands of modern aircraft production. These GPUs are indispensable for graphics rendering and advanced computational duties, such as artificial intelligence, simulation, and cybersecurity, in which AMD's and NVIDIA's most recent architectures are particularly proficient. The current global GPU market dynamics are also reflected in the selection of NVIDIA and AMD processors. Thanks to its proprietary technologies and robust software ecosystem, NVIDIA continues to be the preeminent force in high-end GPU performance, particularly for professional and AI workloads. On the other hand, AMD has been making progress, particularly in the consumer and mid-range segments, and is recognized for its competitive pricing and open approach. AMD's market share increased in the fourth quarter of 2024 as a result of NVIDIA's reallocation of production capacity to data center GPUs, which resulted in a more balanced supply landscape. PJSC IL can mitigate supply risks and guarantee access to the most recent GPU technologies by procuring from both suppliers despite the global demand for these chips continuing to increase. The Voronezh Modernization Project is a component of a broader national initiative to replace imports in Russia's high-tech industries. To speed the integration of domestic electronic components into critical aircraft systems, such as avionics and navigation for both manned and unmanned platforms, the Ministry of Industry and Trade allocated 1.5 billion rubles in early 2025. This strategy is intended to enhance the resilience of Russia's aerospace sector and decrease dependence on foreign technology in the face of changing geopolitical and economic conditions. Digital transformation is not a new concept for PJSCIL. In its EL-112V program, the company has already implemented sophisticated information management systems. Assembly personnel utilize terminals to access interactive documentation and 3D models. These capabilities will be further enhanced by the new hardware software systems, which will facilitate a wide range of activities, including secure facility access and surveillance and real-time design collaboration. Founded in 1932 as the Voronezh Aviation Plant, the Voronezh facility has a rich and illustrious history. After VESO's formal liquidation in 2021, the facility is now under the management of PJSC IL. It continues to play a critical role in Russian aviation by producing and servicing the most recent IL-96 400M, AN-148, IL-112V, and components for the L-76 MD-90A, SSJ-100, and MC-21. This procurement is a clear indication that Russian aviation manufacturers are placing a high priority on the digital infrastructure that underpins modern aerospace engineering, 
in addition to the physical production of aircraft. At a time when both companies are at the forefront of GPU innovation, the use of NVIDIA and AMD chips ensures that PJSCIL remains competitive in a swiftly evolving technological landscape. It is anticipated that the integration of these sophisticated hardware-software systems will result in substantial advantages in the future, including enhanced security, increased operational efficiency, and improved design and simulation capabilities. It also enables PJSCIL to more effectively implement the government's import substitution policy by using domestic and allied technologies whenever feasible. Now, do you think Russia needs to make its own information technology hardware sector strong, or will it rely on the West forever? Let us know in the comments. Feel free to like, subscribe, and share our videos. Also, we invite you to join our membership